So what is your opinion of lobbying? So lobbying, I think, is a necessary evil um, because I think there's some groups out there that greatly benefit from having a lobbyist and having an activist um, go to Capitol Hill and present their issue for them because I don't know that they have the ability to do so. However, I think there are other groups that um, use lobbyists in uh, malicious intent with malicious intent, and I think it be, can be very quickly um, bled into um, corruption because a lot of times with lobbyists, um, you don't know who is a lobbyist unless you're really actively involved in, in following politics and government. You don't really know when it happens because there's not sort of disclosures when you have a quick side conversation with a lobbyist in an elevator. Um, it, so it's very quickly can be um, one construed as, as corruption or just straight up corruption because, you know, the public doesn't really have knowledge uh, on that and how how those meetings and, and discussions are conducted. Um, so they kind of, they tried to combat that when it came to um, uh, campaign contributions. So now everybody that gets funds has to disclose where these funds came from, except for super PACs, which is, it's a whole nother discussion. But lobbying, um, it's kind of difficult to tap into that. Like you can't record, okay, I had a conversation with person ABC uh, about XYZ and they offered me a steak dinner <laughs> to get to to put their uh, bill through which is illegal and that wouldn't happen but my point is is that it's difficult to capture when um, those conversations are happening and what the outcome of those conversations are so I think it can very easily be put into or morphed into corruption so it's it's kind of I think it's good on some parts but it can very easily be very very bad